So we will have Butler versus Siena Heights, and we are off with the kickoff. Basing Pencil comes up and wins that 50 against Siena Heights. Portable Thor wins another great 50, taking it up the up the field. Butler waiting, and Ham going up for the ball, pushing it forward. Half sends coming back up and throwing it back down the field though. Half send sends it back up mid from Butler. Gigi's going up for the ball. Portable Thor beats him to the ball, jumps off the wall, gets the ball in a decent position, and Ham is there to clear the ball though. Young man now takes it. Basic fence all right, taking it off the wall. Cannot get the flip, unfortunately. Young man takes the ball, bouncing at the back line. It is another miss from Butler, unfortunately. In him is there though to collect and clear the ball. Gets a demo by affordable Thor. GG is there to back up and take the, the ball up the field. Cleared out by Sen Heights though. Basing pencil back. He touches it, gives it back to Enham. Brings up GG going for the jump. He shoots just off the crossbar. Enham going up the wall now, setting this ball back for Butler. Fortunately, not the best pass, and Siena Heights are able to clear it, but GG wins another great 50. And now Half Suns takes it. Facing Pencil going up. Going for the shot. It is saved by Siena Heights. GG there to follow, and he gets the goal. First goal goes to Butler. So facing Pencil with the great shot, forcing Siena to take the save, and then GG is there to clean up. Very nice and easy. 3.35 left, there's a lot of game to play. Floyd Balthor with the kickoff. Young man takes the ball, and Ham is there for the follow. Floyd Balthor brings it up, goes for the second shot, no one is there in goal, and he gets the shot! A great solo play there by a Floyd Balthor. He just gets an easy pass right to him, goes up for the shot, and no one's back in uh, Butler's goal to defend. The score is now 1-1. About three minutes left in the game to play. The kickoff. It is won by Santa Heights. Half sends up the wall. Takes the ball. Passes it mid. GG is there for the clear. Ball is in midfield. Enham jumps. Touches the ball backwards. Basic pencil there. Put in a tough spot. He cannot do much with that ball. GG unfortunately doesn't get a good clear off the wall. And a thorable four with another shot. So right here, young man just gets the ball. Actually, he gets the pass. Gigi wasn't able to get any uh, anything on that ball. And Zihana with another goal, but they're down by one. Three minutes left in the game. Even kickoff. Left back for Enham. Brings up the field. This Adapus unfortunately can't do anything with that ball. And Siena does get the clear. The base pencil brings it right back. Affordable Thor bringing it up the wall. Goes for the ceiling shot. Does get a nice touch. Young man going for the ball off the crossbar. They cannot convert Butler with the save. Affordable Thor goes for the ball when Butler is a little bit in disarray on the defense. Young man able to shoot the ball. Gigi with a great save jumping off the wall for that. And Ham misses the ball unfortunately. Basing pencil only one back. GG takes the ball, gives it right back to Basing Pencil. Santa Heights is back and ready to defend. They throw it across the goal line, and Young Man is up the wall to bring it up. But GG with a great 50 win. Fortunately, gets demoed by Young Man. Enham cannot get the touch on that to get the shot. Basing Pencil passes it mid. No one there for Mother to receive, though. GG back from getting demoed. Brings up the wall. Tries to go for something, can't do much. Basing Pencil can't get much done. And Ham jumps. But can I get that second touch? GG going up the wall now. Ford Bathor with an easy clear. Knocks the ball down. Tosses it mid. Basing Pencil with a nice touch. But on Butler's half, there's a great demo from Half Sends. And Ham is able to run back and get that ball though. Cleared off. No one's back. To follow that from Butler. Half Sends bringing it up. Gets another demo on GG. No one is home in Butler's goal. And that is a nice, another easy goal. A 4 Thor, 3 for 3 now on this team. Half Sense gets a great demo. 
Enham goes for the ball, unfortunately misses, and Butler is just scrambling to get back to the goal, and they cannot get that shot, so Sydney Heights goes up by two. It's very important now for Butler to stabilize and try to get some momentum back. Try to get another uh, scoring opportunities in this game. For now, the ball is just sent all the way back, up in the air. Young man goes for the shot, is able to score that. Another goal. Just let go through the goal. Yeah, what happened was the ball was just sent up back, no one went for it, and it seemed like Butler thought someone else was going to go for the ball. GG missed the, the ball off the wall, and then Ham was forced to jump back and miss the ball. Now it is 4-1 to the advantage of Santa Heights. Kick off, GG's ready for the goal. Sends it back, doesn't get any great clear on that. But there is there to bring the ball back, though. Ford Thorpe brings the ball up. Cannot get the second touch on the wall, but it is right in front of Butler's goal. And Ham does, is able to clear the ball. But Sin Heights is right back and ready. The Butler with a great save. Gigi sends the ball up. Not the best touch, just passes it right to Sienna. And Ham is able to bring... The ball does not get the second touch to continue the pressure. Basic pencil up. Tosses the ball mid to Forbel Thor with an easy clear back. And Ham does prevent the ball from being in the goal from there. Now he's pushing up. Another demo from Florbel Thor. Ten seconds left in the game. High shot. Just easily goes in the goal. Florbel Thor. Four goals in this game. The ball was sent to the wall. He just goes up. And gets a nice, just clear shot. But they're not too proficient on the defense in this first game. We do have a five-game series, though. Long way to go. GG, nice fast kickoff. And Hemp tosses it mid. But the ball will drop. And this first game will be going to Santa Heights. Ooh, they actually get a goal as the zero seconds. Young man throws it mid. They get a great bounce, and he's just able to score that. That is always not a fun feeling to get scored on, even if it doesn't matter. But Santa Heights does go up 1-0 in this series. Four more games to go, two for Santa to win. So what we want to see for Brothers, we need to see some more defensive plays. There have There is most likely <coughs> some rotation problems from our Butler team, causing them to not have someone back in goal for just a affordable Thor to basically just get an easy shot and to score. So hoping for a brother to continue the pressure that they had in the very beginning, in those beginning two minutes, keep up that pressure, and hopefully get, get some more wins. Give us a good show in this first game of our Collegiate Star League uh, season. So getting into game number two. Ten up, 1-0. The most important thing is getting a good start. Getting the first pressure and getting, getting into that nice rhythm. Butler does win that kickoff. Gigi's able to take the ball. Can he get that shot in? Oh, it's a great save from half sends. Gigi almost able to make that solo play right off kickoff. But that is a great start for Butler. Now young man throwing the ball and Gigi unfortunately misses and young man with a goal. So after the ball was saved by Sydney Heights, young man just goes up for the ball. And Gigi just could not make that save. Unfortunate start for Butler, but a whole game to play. There should be no worries here. Kickoff. Ford Bathor wins. GG with a great follow-up. And Ham loses the 50 to Young Man. Sienna Heights has the pressure. Can't get much done. Ford Bathor up the wall in Butler's corner. Passes it mid. No one's there. Basic pencil with a great clear. Nope. Another demo from Senna in the goal line. Unfortunately, no one can capitalize as the ball was in Butler's corner. Senna still with the pressure. Trying to set it up is out of boost. Cannot do anything. And Ham takes that. A four-blood floor is there for the clear. Young man goes for the shot, and he gets it. Yeah, from right here, Butler was... They double committed on the defense, and then basic mental missed that save, and from there... Goal was just wide open for Sin Heights to capitalize. So Butler is having some trouble getting some sort of rhythm together. 
Four minutes left in the game. More than enough time to score two goals. And him up for the ball. Cannot get the second touch. Half sentence with control. Dribbles it up. Gigi takes the ball from him. Pass midfield. Facing pencil. Off to Gigi. Half sentence goes for the save. Is the ball's missed. Wide open in the midair. He is taken to Santa's corner. Pass back mid. No one on bother to capitalize on that goal. Gigi in Santa's corner sends it up. Basic Metzl misses the aerial. And half sends. <coughs> Does not get the clear. And Ham wins it. Basic Metzl back. Takes it up the side. Floor before with the clear. A little bit off from Gigi's shot. And the floor before with the pressure. Gets the demo on and Ham. Brings it up and around, and that is another goal from Siena Heights. A 4 before 4 just basically brings the ball up. It's a nice clear cross, and no one from other goes up to defend. Just some great defensive work by uh, Siena Heights, and some either poor communication or poor rotation from Butler. Now, young man has control, and he comes out of the goal, gets a nice clear. Floor floor again. Takes it up. GG there to prevent him from going any farther. Now Sienna. Has control sent mid. The man throws it to the goal and he gets that shot again. Sienna Heights is just having free reign of this game virtually. Just a nice pass off that side wall and... Young man just takes an easy shot, and Butler does not, un unfortunately, does not get any save on that ball. Four before, knocks that ball down from the ceiling. Ball is in Butler's side. Ooh, that was a very close ball. It was a good save for Basic Pencil to prevent that ball from going in. Jumps for the ball, gets sent up, and him. Does get the ball out, but a floor floor is right there to get it. Ball's dropping down. This Betsy Pencil does run to another member, but is able to regain his footing. Floor before. Right to Enham. He gets bumped right out of the way, gives it right back to a floor before. Half send sends it up. It is saved by Enham. GG with a double commit as well. But no worries there. Pressure's on for Sienna, but easily sent back. And him gets a nice save. Clears the ball up to pass to Gigi. Fortunately, can't get a better touch in that corner, and the ball is cleared out by Sienna. Demo from Young Man on to Basing Pencil. Half Sense wins that 50. Young Man hits the ball into the corner. Portable Thor goes. Cannot get the touch. Gigi there to stabilize. Pass to Butler. Taken back by Santa Heights. His threats up the wall. Clears it over a young man's head. Into Senna's corner. A photo of four brings it up. Gigi brings it across. Up the wall, clears it. This ball is on the back wall. It is cleared out though by Sienna. Now on to Butler's side. And Ham is up. Doesn't have any boost. Does get the clear. Gigi with the follow up. Doesn't get a great touch on it. Now Enham low on boost. Tries to go for the save, but affordable Thor is there to capitalize. Fortunately, GG and Basic Mental could not get anything on that ball, so as it comes down, Enham's forced to make a save with no boost. And that's just an easy shot there by Santa Heights, now up 5-0 in the second game of our series. Senna with controlled kickoff. Gigi with a great clear. Senna there to bring it back. Tosses it right back to Enham. Who gets a shot, but affordable throw brings it right back. Basic Mental brings it to the side. Gives Young Man a nice touch. Enham brings it up. Gigi doesn't get a great follow. Basic Mental up mid. Grabbed by affordable four. Woods is shot right to half sends, and that goes in! It was almost a save from GG. Unfortunately, the ball got trapped in the goal and just. A 4 before with a nice um, 
Antron from the side does finish that ball for Siena. Now 6 0 up against Butler. It's a really tough showing for Butler so far. Just not able to get anything done. Siena just basically choking them out. As soon as Butler gets a ball on Siena's side, they basically just clear it out and no one's able to follow up. In the final seconds of game two, ball's knocked up and falls. And that is 2 0 to Santa Heights. Young man and Affordable Thor doing most of the work for this team. In that first game, Affordable Thor got four of their five goals. And now Young Man takes it up in this game, scoring four of his own. Unfortunate start from Butler, but. Crazier things have happened than a reverse sweep. What we want to come out and see, Butler just has to get some rhythm going. Santa just as immediately as they get control, they basically do not let up the gas. Butler basically just needs to get something going. Just needs to get into some rhythm. Ball's on Santa's side. Half sends, sends it over Enham's head. QG is back. Gets the ball before he is demoed by Young Man. Half sends though, sends it up. Affordable Thor right over the top of them gets that first goal. So Young Man does get a nice demo, throws it off to Half Sends, who's on the wall waiting, and then Affordable Thor is just faster to that ball. Santa Heights up 1 0. In this third game, possibly the last game of this series. Kickoff. No one has one yet. Ball just gets thrown up and back down. Enham is there. Throws in Santa's corner. No one is there to follow. Enham can't get the ball on that ceiling. Basic Pencil throws it up. Continues to follow the ball. Half sense throws it mid. Right to Gigi who gets a nice shot and he actually gets that in. Cross bar down. A great, um, great work from Gigi. Just being able to capitalize on that Shot just thrown into the middle by Santa Heights. So, for the first time in a long time, it feels like Butler is finally getting some rhythm going. And this next kickoff, and him. There for the clear on the Santa side, but Young Man is quick to send it right back. Basic pencil throws it mid. No one there to follow for Butler. Third before, takes it, throws it up. Basic Mensa over his head. GG throws it into the wall. No one waiting back in Butler's goal. And that's another goal to Sienna. Yeah, there's no third no third man left. Basic Mensa went for the save. And it was GG last man. Couldn't get a good good touch on it. And just wide open goal for Sienna. A, just under four minutes left in this game. Butler can still stabilize and come back. Shot over the goal. Cleared by Enham. Takes the ball up. Basic Pencil follows it up. Gets the shot right up, right up above. Straight down. Butler is not there in time to capitalize. Half sends backflips. Almost own goals. But Sin Heights is able to save that ball and send it Butler's way. A nice drop down shot. Basic Pencil. That shot a bit wide from Sin Heights. Sent up. Basic Mensa back. It's like against the wall, sends it mid. Before before with the win on the 50. Sends it into Santa's corner. GG sends it up. Half sends. Clears it out. Right to Basic Mensa. Sends it to the wall. Thor intercepts. Close ball off the corner. Young man up against the wall. Cleared by Butler. Four before off the ceiling. Goes across the goal. Right into Butler's hands. Basic pencil. Takes it up the wall. Sends it into Santa's corner. Right midfield. It is saved by four before. And Gigi loses the 50 to Sienna. Dangerous ball in Butler's corner. Gigi is able to get a touch on that ball. Basic pencil. Backflips. Those are the side. Pull before up the wall. One by Enham. 
and she's just able to clear that ball mid. Young man up, gets the ball back into the first corner. Basic Mental brings it up to a wide open goal, and that is another Butler goal. 2-2 two to two in this third game of the series. So Thor before just basically passes the ball, and Basic Mental just take, is able to just take an easy shot. And we have 2-2 two to two going into these last two minutes of our third game. Butler, fighting for the lives, just need one goal to win this. Basic Pencil throws it off the side. Butler double commits on the ball, no one is back in time to get that ball, and that is an easy shot by half sends. Yeah, unfortunately there, GJ and Enham both go for the same ball. Leaving Basic Mental out to dry in their half after passing that ball mid. Seems like a lack of communication for Butler today. This is the first game of the uh, of the league, of Collegiate Star League. So we should expect Butler to work out those kinks as the season goes on. But, Florida Thor with the shot. No one home for Butler, and that is another goal by Santa Heights. Half sends and the... 404 both they go for the ball. But Butler was not expecting that shot. And just easily goes in the net. In the final minute, 40 seconds in this game. What well, could be the last game of the series. GG up the wall. Unable to, to hit that. Basic Mental with the follow-up. Sends it mid. And Ham unfortunately misses the ball. Young man now. Sends it mid. Right to basic pencil. No one home for Sienna. Basic Mental tosses it in mid, gets a nice touch, but they're unable to capitalize on that open goal. GG now back, sends it into the corner, Affordable Thor hits against the wall and saves it. Half settings throws it mid to Young Man who follows it up into Butler's corner. GG throws it mid, off the back wall for Butler. Dangerous ball below the goal, Half sends jumps and goes for it. Another goal, Santa Heights. Seemed like a bit of chaos with everyone going for this ball right here. No one able to hit that ball. And half sends just sits in the back, jumps for it, just gets an easy shot. Now Butler down by three in what could be the last game of this series. Young man gets the ball around basic pencil. Bounces off Butler's corner. Four ball floor. Off the ceiling. Goes it towards the goal. And Ham misses the ball and half sends just knocked it in. Unfortunate little defense from there. Affordable Thor gets a nice touch off the ceiling, and Ham possibly not ready for it. And unfortunately, Half Sense just capitalizes on that nice and open goal. 6-2, Sienna. GG wins the kickoff. Into Sienna's corner. Basic Mental throws it mid. And Ham doesn't get the touch. And the ball just flies in the Butler's net! Yeah, what happened here? Basic Mental throws against the back wall, hoping for Enham to be there. Fortunately, isn't able to get there. And Young Man just throws that ball down the field. Gets an open net. Now Butler down by five. Game three. Enham knocks the ball to the side. A throwable four can't. Followed up. Basic Mental's there. Throws it down mid. GG. Over a few of heads, and actually right into the goal! Another great solo play by GG this game. Basic Pencil possibly fakes out the team, not getting that touch. And GG's able to just hit that ball, and Santa just scores it in their own net, a throw before. Own going, giving Butler a... a less of a deficit this game. Now, GG wins the 50. Young Man is there for clearance. GG off the back wall. Butler unfortunately does not get the follow up. Ball just flies across. Sends net. And in these last seconds, Sienna Heights will be taking this series. 3 to nothing. Butler tried their best. They showed some fight in this last game, but Affordable Thor and Young Man just winning those first two games for them, and then Sienna comes alive in this last game and doesn't give any space to Butler. 